uh, in the international scenes or not, but it, it is it is showing uh, quite potential here. Tides are, is trying to get some vision. Uh, Lemu is also trying to get some vision, but there ha there's no aggression anymore from the side of Team Key Best Gaming. Now, then we'll, ha we'll have to wait for their timings for now, knowing that they have the carry anyways that can supplement enough damage. There will be mm. a little bit of a clash in here as uh, it'll be the Valentina copying the Circling Eagle only up until that point and then uh, gets out. They want to fight into the bottom lane. They're eyeing the carry this time, but they can reach the regime. Yeah, there is the Ooh. damage. I'll put them in there from the sphere. But at least Keepers Gaming will react. It's going to be the Martis on the other side. Tides going for the poke. Carry defending himself. Iksha activates the ultimate. Wants Ooh. to go for Tides. Tides low. Tides take it out. Owl on point at the tip of the ultimate. Now Rindo wants to go for the Martis, but this is just buying them time to finish up the turret in the bottom lane. The full barrage and the mobility coming from the Matilda here is so insane. They just got a turret in the six minutes mark and Team K Best Gaming is just withdrawing. They are going back with 2.5 gold lead for the favor of Team Burning Splash. They are taking turret right now. They are taking so much advantage and Team K Best Gaming are almost surrendering to the pressure that Burn X Splash are applying. The third turtle is down uh, in the land of Dawn and both of them are just um, watching that turtle going down without any contesting this time is from the time of Team Burnex Flash and Ooh. the penalty zone. Yeah, penalty zone. Connects on to two. There's the friend. But Kelvy J is the one to take it. It's going to be just one. A uh, little bit of Martis. Flicker out from I'm your ATM. Not going to hit. Oh, it actually ticks off <laughs> the Martis. And that's going to be a confirmed kill. Mid lane. They're looking for more targets here. Penalty zone is down and he's being poked down. LMU will just uh, recall his way out of there, but they're still trying to, de to push. Defense coming up from Keep Best Gaming will make sure that the, tur the turret in the middle will be intact. That's going to be a, just a pickoff for Burning Slash, but a jungler that they were able to take out. After a really good and a solid early game, I think that Team Keep Best Gaming, after just seeing and experiencing some of the pressure that Team Burn X Flash have applied, are going back and, and they are not going back in style. Looking here at key, Team uh, KPG, there's something that I'm really wondering about. I'm waiting for the items to show up, but I didn't see any roaming item coming from any player from the side of Team Key Best Gaming. Maybe it's a, a strategy, maybe it's something else. Miko going to be going for tides. Look at Rainbow controlling Rainbow as well. They took Ooh. down the Greedy Bear. They want more. That's Rainbow going down. The Chain Stun's coming out from Burning Slash, holding to be true. And they were able to push up top as well. Look at the macro coming out from Burning wow. Slash there, playing this early game so perfectly. Taking both bot lane and also top lane, and they are now even taking that second tier in the in the top lane. Full barrage being activated by Owl, buying some time, bushing and, and getting some space out. And look here! Oh, what was that? Kill VJ on point. The echo as well as the meteor connecting in combination with each other, and that means that they will get another bonus skill. That's a Valentina taken out. And we know for sure that. Gail VJ has been one of the one of the great players coming out from the Philippines. Now playing the uh, position four or the mid lane, showing off in the burn next flash. Burn next flash are having uh, I would say two imports right now. Right now, right? They have Miko and Owl, right? Yeah. So right. we we are seeing them having uh, an upgrade, not an upgrade, but playing with different players and seeing them with different style. Right now, Key Best Gaming are also having an import in this match, which is just X1. Ooh. And now we are seeing the old myth. Ooh, full by Rash under the penalty zone, and now saved by the Matilda Miko saves. I'm your ATM, and that confirms the Lord take for Burn X Flash. Wonderful Lord Dance for uh, coming out from Burnix Flash as they took advantage of their economy lead. And that meant that Kate Best Gaming were able to position themselves around the Lord. It's 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 a little bit hard um, after the last patch to make that Lord dance last long because right now the Lord bit range is a little bit smaller, so much smaller I would say. Uh, so it, it doesn't have that that much space for them to make the Lord dance. So it was a really fast Lord for Team Burn X Splash. The gold is just increasing by the minute and Team Burn X Splash having three, oh my God, three members, four members in the bot lane, bushing so hard, trying to get the passive of the inhibitor turrets. Zexwan is trying, oh, the second skill just misses out. 
I, 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 if he wants to fight, he's gonna turn it around, but he's far too low. Three versus one, he loses it. Miko far too late, but now in comes the cavalry. Coming out from Burnick Slash Rito, looking for a target. There's a barrage, connecting onto three members of Game Best Gaming. They took out two, they want more. Martis tries to run. There's the there's lockup coming out from Rindo. Lot of damage for now. Astral Echo connects onto three members. That's the dodge coming out from Kill VJ. SCU will not land the hook. They still mm. want more. The turret gonna be taken out. Inhibitor down up top, and Burnix Flash will not stop pushing. Burnix Flash are out for blood. We see here that the Novaria is just targeting the damage dealers, making their heart, their times are making their life so hard to live. Seeing Key Best Gaming going back behind their inhibitor turrets before the 11 minutes mark in the game. And seeing here the damage output coming from the Novaria is just insane. In a matter of 11 minutes, she can take down half HP of the damage dealers just with one second skill. Yeah. 3 0 oh, 5 for Kill VJ. They want to go for the red tree. Short Sarah connects mm -hmm. to 2. But now the Circling Eagle, copied by the Valentina. Just for fending off Burning Smash for the build, he's all connected to two onto the back lines with a flicker and he gets out because of Miko's guiding wind. They still want more. They found Tights. Tights wants to jump, but he's now being taken out. Down he goes. Two for the side of Keep Best Gaming. He still want more rainbow. Do you really want to fight Ooh. this? Kill VJ dealing the damage, but without any minions, Burning Smash will just stop for now. It's just a pause. Because it mm -hmm. kind of feels like they still want more. Miko on the hunt, looking for an initiation. Rainbow and LMU going for the bottom lane defense. Gonna be the turret, uh, uh, the turret defense in the mid lane gonna be pop, but didn't matter because Verdict Flash are still able to take out the inhibitor in the mid lane. Withdrawing and going back to the Lord uh, Duties. Buried by the mistakes that they have done throughout the early game stage. Team Key Best Gaming are forced to defend from minute number 10. And right now we are seeing the second Lord being taken so easily without any type of contestant between them and Team Key Best Gaming. Right now Team Burn X Flash are speaking and Team Key Best Gaming are just listening the second skill. Oh, look at the vision. Or man echo into the circling eagle to knock up some doom. And now the penalty zone to go for more. Ooh. And they have bouncing you. They have the taunt. They have the damage what? barrage. Alex, and they took out two members. Look at the Matilda. The combo in the Ixia. They will take out four, a double, even in a triple. Versailles of Burnix Flash. And the Greedyver cannot defend this. No minions in the mid lane for now. But that mm. should be it. The combination coming up from Burnix Flash exploding. Keep us gaming just like that. They found tides. Oh. That should be it. Base in shambles. Burnix Flash takes game one. Burn X Flash are doing magnificent work in the last and also the kill 6 to 2 so all the statistics all the numbers are going for, uh, to the favor of team Burn X Flash and I'm afraid of something so far I haven't seen Owl inside any uh, any team fight imagine the damage coming from the Nolan in the upcoming stages for now, we have to worry about I'm your ATM. He actually survives for now. And painting Ooh. out the members of Keepers Gaming. Outplay coming out from the entirety of Burnix Flash. They punish Ooh. one. And look at that. Initiation coming from Miko. Catching three. Goes down though. Because of the damage of the turret. And now KLVJ in a terrible spot. I'm your ATM to save his teammate. Where's Rindo? He's trying to go for it. The flicker play coming from I'm your ATM. Gets out to safety. And then Life steals his way out. KLVJ taken out as well. See you. Ooh. The double kill. Burnix Flash disrespected Keep Us Gaming, but there's the punish. Eventually, Keep Us Gaming are able to finally recover this game. Wow, Greed has blinded Team Burnix Flash for a moment, using the conceal and getting inside the second tier of the top lane without having any minions to support that decision and losing three, four of the members in the previous in the previous team fight looking at the bot lane i think that cc is doing a lot of work for team key best gaming taking the kills and taking the turrets and also applying a tremendous amount of pressure having all that mobility and also having all that sustainability with the hp and the defenses tights even after the magic defense 
junk so low that he would not be able to position himself around this uh, Lord fight. Echo connects on the three members of Burnix Flash. Mm. But Rito is not hit by that ultimate coming up from the Navaria. They're holding on to the Lord. Echo expires. And Burnix Flash will just try to clear out the minion wave in the middle first as they are able to reset the Lord. The Lord, I think that the Lord will be so helpful, but not as helpful as expected for both teams. I think that the more important thing here is to take that team fight back home. Team yeah. Burnex Flash are looking for an opening. They are asking for a team fight. They are not asking for the Lord itself. Look at Miku and look at the positioning and look at Team yeah. Burnex Flash. They got him. There's the ultimate. See you. Will it activate the Vengeance? Get out. I'm your ATM. Wants to go for the play. Does not hit. That tickles. The proper target. But that <laughs> means that they will slowly chunk onto the Lord. Martis looking that... for an angle. Found by Imer ATM. There's the combo. There's the crowd control. And now Tides. Good for Ooh. two. There's the barrage as well. Connecting on Miko. Miko is down. But the Lord going to be going in favor of Key Best Gaming. It'll be a kill. As the, uh, as the Nathan now deals the damage. That's oh my God. actually a W for Key Best Gaming as they've traded for the Lord. Well, one that for was one the trade first time. Exactly. Right? That was the first time that we see Team Keep Us Gaming playing aggressive in the middle game That's or right. even like going through uh, inside the game. Did you see that flicker ultimate for, with the full barrage coming from the Ixie exactly. and the perfect execution for the Retribution? I think that they have so much to offer and so far they are trying to tie things up on the top lane. The Lord is, re um, is reaching on the second tier and so far there will be no other lane to be pressured other than the top lane. That's net positive for sure for Keepless Gaming. They want more tights. Ooh. That's the barrage. No flicker yet. They are trying to go for the CC. So aggressive in Ooh. that case. Almost taking out Amir 18 as well. And then they forced the holy nah. defense up top. But Rindo, he finds the snipe. He finds the kill onto the Martis. And immediately goes for the invasion onto the jungle. Heights finds this Ixia. Wow. No flicker, but he will not be too aggressive. Look <laughs> at LMU. Had to go for the flicker because Miko is threatening. They're able He's to steal so off the orange buff. Knight tries to outplay and eventually gets out. Good crossover. But mm -hmm. with all the time that Rindo was able to buy for Burning Slash, now the minions are in the mid lane and Keep Best Gaming will lose their tier 2 in the mid. I cannot believe how things switch up so quickly between those two teams. Look at how, look at the damage from the Nova. Full barrage being used, but no targets inside for Team Key Best Gaming. 60 seconds, a full minute is between. Oh, second skill from Tides. Yep. It's gonna be a good usage of the barrage to fend off Burnix Flash. And he mm -hmm. was able to take out the, the orange mob, but oh my goodness, look Whoa. at that. Palatina copying the Astral Echo and actually connects onto five owl to take out CU with all of the slows in the world. CC could not escape a burn X flash off of wow. a good IMU coming up from Kel VJ. That was wonderful. <laughs> at some point, looking at the Nolan and the amount of uh i would say danger that he uh, that he made team key best gaming witness did you see the amount of fear by using that flicker instantly from the novarian also from uh from the ixia they know that just with one click rindu can make them vanish from the land of dawn so 10 seconds exactly. are now separating us from the next i would say team fight i would not say the lord i would say next team fight they will have that team fight and their excuse will be taking the Lord. Wow, Tides. Tides almost taken out. And there's no one to check this Lord take. Martis even, <laughs> they know, they know that he's there because the Kramer was chasing him and now he has to get out. And that means Burning Splash will easily take the Lord. Just a poke onto Tides, forcing that flicker. It was already enough for Burning Splash to secure that Lord dance. Ah, 14 minutes inside the game, almost 14 minutes inside the game, and we have 7k, almost 8k difference between both teams in terms of the goal. So far, we haven't seen the items, but we will see that. Oh, look at the top lanes. He's being chased. Rindo might be shut down. Or is it going to be the case? We don't know yet. Rindo gets out, commits the ultimate. 
Mm. Unpunished for now. Miko wants to look for the CC. Oh no, the worst case, uh, the, the worst bush to go for the TP, and now he's caught. He lost time, and now everybody from Burdick Slash knows it's too brutal, Yasu. We can't even see it. Wow. The camera just won't <laughs> show it because it's too brutal. This is violence. We don't show violence on screen here. Exactly. <laughs> Lord marching up top. Brindo. We're receiving so much damage from Keep This Gaming with the Retribution. He gets out think... into safety. I think this is this might be the end. They have a they have the, the numbers in their favor. They have everything. They have the engage. Maybe Miko with a flicker that. I'm offended can land in, but I think that they want to take it a piece by piece, like a puzzle. Yeah. They want to take everything at a time. And the Nathan's damage is just Ooh. overwhelming. Barrage no connects on to many members of Burning Slash, but the sustain is there. There's the flicker in. Still no connection. No one dying. Ooh, Ooh I say that though. It's the <laughs> lightning truncheon that took a kill, VJ. That was the lightning truncheon, right? That was a tremendous damage. Second skill coming from the Novaria, just with the tiniest different. Like it was one milli um, centimeters so, away, <laughs> millimeters yeah. away from the second skill, and just with the use of the ultimate of Novaria, it was able to be landed upon uh, KLVG. Tides, I, I would say something really awkward here. I think that the tank is getting melted down with the, uh, after seeing, just by seeing Rindo. I think that when Tides show up on the map, two skills from Rindo are being able to almost take him down. Imagine if he did and he dealt that damage upon the damage dealers. Oh, they have found the Martis. Back-to-back -back retributions. Ooh. There's Owl with the ultimate and they have the damage five against one. It's not fair at uh. all. Keep best gaming punished as their jungler is taken out 20 seconds before the Lord spawns. That is really bad for keep best gaming. That must have hurt. That must have hurt Zach Swan in the bot lane 172. He's being focused and he's being taken out of the game so hard and so harsh by Team Burn X Flash. They are trying to engage though. They are trying to engage. Nico Low. There's the barrage. Not gonna clean off anyone from Burn X Flash. Super Paddy didn't have the flicker to take mm. them down. Good attempt from Keep Best Gaming because they didn't lose any of their members. But that means that Burnix Flash will just secure the Lord. Burnix Flash team, I think that with this Lord is so hard to be defended. But after seeing the full barrage, after seeing the damage output that to oh, Oa, I, I take down my words. I take back my oh words. My I was just about to talk about Axia and that she might do the defense. 40 seconds is so much for Team Key Best Gaming to hold that upcoming Lord. The upcoming Lord is an enhanced Lord with a passive and he might just be the ending Lord for Team Burn X Flash and taking that full sweep. I'm very team with the initiation. They took out the turret in the middle. Mm. Look at the damage coming from the Nathan. So <laughs> much. And they burst it down. Nolan and Nathan combined for two. And now the base in shambles. Burn X Flash will sweep Keep Best Gaming. It took a...